Welcome back to module two of finding articles in our databases. We found an article that we thought was very good in education source on adult Hispanic ESL students and graded readers. We found that if we clicked the site button, we could scroll down and get an APA style reference that we could copy and paste in our um, paper. But we also see here that we could export it to a bibliographic management software. And we do have that what called reference. We could either click here or we could click the export button, which is set up to direct export to reference. Let's save that. Let's click save. And immediately a interface comes up. This one is for RefWorx Legacy, and we will click that one. So let's click RefWorx Legacy. In another module, you learned how to set up an account. So we'll assume that you have set up your account, and we are going to enter our names. We encourage you to use your NJCU email. And I'm going to put in my password. I'm going to log in. And then we will click View Last Imported Folder. And there is the article Martinez, comma, Lisa B. E adult Hispanic ESL students and graded readers. If we wanted to, we could click this, select this, and we could click create a bibliography with APA 6. We would have a formatted citation that we could use for our bibliography. If we go back, Sorry. If we go back and X out of this, we'll also see that we could put it in a folder. So if we wanted to make a new folder and call it ESL Research, we could do that, create. And when we look over here, there is ESL research. We could just select this and drag it in to ESL research. Now I'm just to show you, I'm going to go to, um, I have a folder with three references. So I'm going to click on that and show you how the bibliography works. I'm going to click on this. I'm going to select all. I'm going to click Create Bibliography, APA 6. And there are all of my um, citations ready to be copied into a reference list. We can either copy them or we could even print out this page. So that's the way that RefWorx very efficiently um, uh, creates bibliographies for you. So I hope this has been useful and um, will be useful for your research. So today, what we've learned is how to export from our data, export a citation from our databases. We've learned how to open RefWorks. We've learned how to create a folder. We've learned how to create a bibliography. Thank you very much and come back soon to the Congressman Frank J. Corini Library for all your research needs.